Today, I'll be reviewing My Neighbor Totoro. I have wanted to review more Studio Ghibli movies for a while now, but I always have to be very careful about using any pictures. Considering I plan to review all the major movies, using pictures for all of them is very risky. The premise for this movie is pretty simple. This movie follows the daily lives of two kids, as they encounter an odd creature named Totoro. Reviewing this movie was very tough. It's clearly made for kids. It's obviously not going to be very appealing for someone like me. To say it's bad though, just because I'm not its intended audience, wouldn't feel right. I get why you enjoy this movie as a kid. It has that classic Studio Ghibli animation style that looks so colorful and appealing. The atmosphere feels so peaceful and relaxing. It was enjoyable seeing Totoro show what cool things can do with surroundings. It's a very upbeat and positive movie. The problem is the plot is basically non-existent. Nothing happens at all. You just see the daily lives of two girls. It's not like it has a comedy or the great cast of characters help make it better. I got bored rather quickly, but again, it's still a good movie. Just not for me. I honestly don't care about the two main characters, and Totoro doesn't really speak, so it's hard to really get to know his personality. The music for this movie was so peaceful and nice to listen to. Of course, the animation style for this movie looked great, and the animation looked really great as well. This is a colorful and upbeat slice of life anime series where nothing important occurs. It's not for me, but I get why some people like it. I give this movie a 7 out of 10.